Hello friends today we are going to learn divisibility rules of 2 3 4 5 and 6 in competitive exams these rules will help let's start the first one is by two rule what this rule says any even number can be divided by 2 so now what is even number any number if it ends in 0 2 4 6 8 then it's a even number let's see some examples the first example is 9212 and this number ends with 2 means it's a even number Hence we can divide this number with 2 and it passes our rule. The next example is 3123. This number ends in 3. Means it is an odd number. Hence we can't divide this number with 2 and it fails the rule. Now let's see the next rule by 3 rule. So what this rule says a number is divisible by 3 if the sum of its digit sum of its digit is divisible by 3. So what is this sum of its digit? Let's see this with an example. 375 As per the rule, we will add the digits. Three plus seven plus five is equal to fifteen. Can we divide fifteen by three? If you are finding this difficult, simply add the digits one plus five, that is six, and check can we divide six by three? Answer is yes. And as this rule is passed, we can say. 375 can be divided by 3 so let's check one more example 265 2 plus 6 plus 5 is equal to 13 so we can't divide 13 by 3 as this test fails we can't divide 265 by 3 I hope you are getting this rules and with practice you can master it as of now we have learned two rules let's continue with the next rule next one is by four rule rule says a number is divisible by four if the number last two digits last two digits are divisible by 4 let's try with example 9312 here 12 is last two digit so can we divide 12 by 4 obviously yes as this test is passed we can say 9312 can be divided by 4 let's look at another example 9322 22 divided by 4 is not possible so rule fails here hence 9322 can't be divided by 4 So next rule is very easy rule. It is by five rule. Rule says a number is divisible by five if its last digit last digit is a zero or five. The first example three thousand fifty five. Its last digit is five. Hence, we can say 
3055 can be divided by 5. Next example is 3026. As its last digit is 6, 3026 can't be divided by 5. Isn't it simple rule? So now we are left with only one rule. That is by 6 rule. 6 is a product of 2 and 3. So let's see what the rule says. A number is divisible by 6 if it is even and if the sum of its digit is divisible by 3. It has two conditions. Indirectly this rule is saying a number should pass rule of 2 and rule of 3. Let's understand with the example. 114 First we will check the rule of 2. As it is an even number, it can be divided by 2. Now let's check the sum of digits. That is 6. 6 can be divided by 3. Hence 114 can be divided by 3. As both the tests are passed, we can say 114 can be divided by 6. So next example is 124. As it's an even number, it can be divided by 2. And the sum of digits is 1 plus 2 plus 4 is equal to 7. 7 can't be divided by 3. So we can't divide 124 by 3. Out of 2, 1 test fails. Hence 124 can't be divided by 6. Let's check one more example. 129 As 129 is not an even number, it can't be divided by 2. And the sum of digits 1 plus 2 plus 9 is equal to 12. 12 can be divided by 3. And so as 129 can be divided by 3. Here also one test fails. Means 129 cannot be divided by 6. That's all for today. In the next video, I am going to cover some more rules. Thanks for watching my video. Please like, share and subscribe. Have a nice time.